Red warning lights in car. What do they mean? The lights are colored red, orange or green and work much like a traffic light system. Red is the equivalent of stop and means the problem needs investigating immediately. Orange is an advisory signal suggesting drivers will need to take action and green says all is clear and serves as a helpful reminder. Today let's talk about all red warning lights on dashboard in car. Brake system light. The first thing to do if you see the symbol glowing on the dashboard is check the handbrake hasn't been left on. Assuming it hasn't, there is a fault with the brake system that could relate to the worn condition of the brake pads or disc, a lack of fluid in the system or a problem with the anti-lock brakes or stability control. ABS or ESP. Have it investigated by a garage as soon as possible. Engine cooling system. To keep their cool, nearly all cars pump coolant fluid around their engines. If this warning light turns on, that coolant level could be dangerously low or a blockage in the system could be causing the engine to overheat. Call out your breakdown provider or seek immediate assistance at the nearest garage. Engine oil pressure. This generally tells drivers that the engine has lost oil pressure or is crying out for a top up of oil. If you can't remember the last time you checked the oil level or had it changed at the garage, there is a good chance it's now at a dangerously low level, which could cause serious damage. So pull in to the nearest petrol station or garage, consult the vehicle handbook and check the engine's oil level. The handbook will advise which type of oil is needed for a top up. Power steering system. Most of us would struggle to turn a steering wheel if a car didn't have what's known as power assistance. This is a hydraulic or increasingly electric pump that helps turn the steering. So when the warning light for the system illuminates, take it seriously and have it checked out by the professional. Airbag red warning light. This red light may appear to be a picture of a passenger balancing a beach ball on their lap, but it means that one of the airbags is malfunctioning. This is a serious matter, as it could fail to inflate in the event of an accident or worse still, inflate without warning while you're driving. Vehicle charging system. The most likely cause of a red light with a battery symbol is that the car battery is no longer charging or something is draining the charge when the car is parked and switched off. A flat battery is one of the most common causes for breakdown technicians being called out. So if the light comes on, your car will need further examination. Steering lock. Usually an amber steering lock symbol will indicate that the car's steering lock needs to be released before the engine can be started. But if it remains red after starting the motor, it suggests there is a malfunction with the mechanism. In that case, don't switch off the engine and head to a garage to have it inspected. Ignition switch. It could indicate an issue with the ignition switch or show that there is a problem with the key being used. If this light comes on while you are driving, chances are the key can longer be verified so you will need to take the car to get checked out. Seatbelt buckles warning light. This light will appear when a passenger in the vehicle has not fastened their seatbelt. Make sure all seat belts are fastened and the light should turn off. Red warning light about doors. This light indicates that one or more doors in the car are not shut properly. Check all of your doors, including the boot, are properly shut. Bonnet. This light turns on when the bonnet is not closed properly. Make sure the bonnet has been closed properly before setting off. Boot. This light turns on when the boot is not closed properly. Make sure the boot has been closed properly before setting off. Recharge at blue, red. Stop the car as soon as it is safe to do so. The red warning light appears when there is no at blue range left. Once this happens, the car will not restart once the ignition is turned off. The system will need a full top up uh, before the car can be restarted. Stop engine. The stop warning light will illuminate alongside another warning light. This is an indication of a critical malfunction that may risk the safety of vehicle occupants. What to do? 
You must stop the vehicle as soon as safely possible, switch off the engine and do not continue to drive. Consult with the garage mechanic. Low fuel level, red warning light. Indicator light means that the car is running low on fuel and will soon need a refill. Tire pressure, red light. Tire pressure sensors often use a battery and a flashing tire pressure light can often be a sign that the battery needs to be replaced. This could also be because of an issue with the sensor. If you notice a flashing tire pressure light, you'll want to schedule a service appointment uh, at the service so they can check it properly. And of course it indicates very low level of tire pressure. Front assist red warning light. If a red front assist warning light appears while you are driving, then it means that front assist has detected that you are at a risk of collision and you should brake immediately or take evasive action. The light will automatically deactivate when the threat has passed. The air suspension light. A red air suspension light indicates that there is a malfunction in the air suspension system. You may not have sufficient ground clearance to continue your journey. Seek assistance immediately. This light also appears as an amber warning if the fault is less severe. The automatic transmission warning light means there is an issue with the transmission, possibly the fluid temperature, fluid level or pressure. Hazard warning lights or emergency flashers are activated by pressing the button on your dashboard which has the symbol of a red triangle. Once pressed, all four of your car's indicator lights will flash simultaneously. Immobilizer warning light. The indicator for the immobilizers behave similarly between different vehicles, but refer to the owner's manual for specific information on your vehicle's system. Generally, when you first start the engine, this light will illuminate for a few seconds, showing that the correct key has been used. If the computer doesn't recognize the code on the key, the light will flash multiple times. You won't be able to start the engine until you see a recognized key. Distance red warning light. This warning light illuminates when the distance to the vehicle in front is too small for the speed selected. An additional warning tone means you are approaching the object at a too high speed. For further information about active brake assist, see owner's manual. Speed limit sign indicator. Triple N denotes the speed value of speed limit sign currently recognized. If there is no speed limit value available, the lamp will display none. When the intelligent speed assist function is activated or slip warning function is enabled, the lamp will flash if the speed limit value is exceed. Please slow down.